After years of South Korea threatening to bomb the United States with its artificial intelligence missiles, they actually went through with it. Unfortunately, the United States was at a disadvantage, they had fallen behind with the advancement of using artificial intelligence in their military, due to them knowing the danger it could hold. South Korea said that they were going to release a missile airstrike to the United States. They stated, we are stronger and more powerful than you. Every other country around the world had regulations they followed to create a safe relationship with artificial intelligence technology, but Korea didn't abide by any rules. The United States military general pleaded to Korea saying, it would be ignorant to release a missile without knowing the repercussions and power it holds. Korea didn't adhere to the warnings and launched a missile killing nearly every single person on Earth from its radiation and miscalculated power. There are now just four of us left on Earth and we are trying to find answers to why we're all still alive and why everyone else died. It has made no sense to us why we've been chosen and kept alive. James, Christine, Mark and myself Lisa are trying to discover answers to what makes us so different. Why us? What in our bodies makes us able to withstand the radiation and not be affected? As we continued to learn about one another and bond, we discovered very unique and odd things we all had in common. We all were orphans with no recollection of who any of our biological family is, our parents were all doctors, and not one of us could feel pain. We all knew that it was more than just coincidences. As we tried to figure out this puzzle piece, I gasped as Amy's fair skin started to peel and turn blue. Amy oh my god, are you okay, what's happening to you, are you in pain? Amy looked over and stated Lisa, it's happening to all of us. As all of our skin turned blue we suddenly remembered who we were, where we came from, and what our purpose was. We were all fabricated and born in a lab made from both organic human DNA and biomechatronic body parts making us all cyborgs. Our physical abilities are extended far beyond the normal human limitations, which is why we were able to withstand the radiation due to the mechanical elements that were built into our bodies. It is now our purpose and duty to use the last amount of human DNA we carry inside us to reproduce and keep the human race from going extinct. This is now the sixth time that humanity has come close to extinction, and hopefully the last. I hope to raise the future generation to become as one, and work together. The only way to break the cycle from humanity destroying itself is to stop bloodshed, and war, and become as one.